part because yeah. you know I've heard so much about Korean pop and uh, even my daughter who is in uh, kindergarten yesterday. She they dancing? Yeah, they have dancing. Oh, there you go. That's how so like, you know yeah. far and popular you know Korean pop culture is. And I must say this might just be the highlight of today's show, the mm -hmm. K-pop dance contest. We have four contestants who will be vying for the top prize, and in fact they'll be showing off their moves to see who does the best job. And the judge for this contest will be our guest earlier this morning, Ambassador Ojun, who will be um, choosing the winner, and so uh, our contestants will have to impress him. That's right. So first of all, we're going to get the ladies here to give us a demonstration as to what our contestants will be dancing. So ladies, are you ready? All right, take it away. Joanna Ejo from Sylvie and Jacindra Lynn School of Performing Arts. Thank you, girls. It was wonderful. Now we're going to invite our four I contestants. I know. It, look, it looks pretty tough. To show our contestants and ladies. Again, they happen to be all ladies. Please come <laughs> in. You will let you get your places. But, I mean, those moves, I think, are going to yeah. be hard to replicate. So as they get mentally prepared for this, let me just tell you what's at stake. Now, the winner of this contest wins a return class ticket to South Korea and a two-night Benikia hotel voucher sponsored by Korea Tourism Organization. And Benikia is Korea's first mid-low-cost tourist hotel chain supported by KTO. And it promises you, it promises you best nights in Korea. So that's a lot of state girls who so give it your best, okay? Have you been to Korea before? Oh, you okay. have, and I'm sure you want to visit again. Yeah. Are you a big fan of uh, K-pop culture, dance, and also uh, dramas? Yeah. Okay. All of them are. So you I'm see sure they've been practicing ahead. very hard in the past few nights. Uh, we gave them a bit of forewarning. So now I think, uh, are you all set? set Ready? Go? Ready? Okay, music okay, please. <laughs> So we'll come forward, come forward, and we will now choose the winner. In fact, Let's our judge... invite uh, Mr. Ambassador in the Tatican. Mr. Come. Ambassador, can you come in and join us? I mean, he's yeah. been watching from the sidelines. I mean, what do you, what do you think? What they, are, they are all very good. Uh, you know, um, I, I have seen Korean dancers and singers, and they are, you know, just as good. good. Very yeah. good. Yeah. I think it will be a difficult process to um, choose the winner, but what, perhaps... Uh, what were you looking for? What was that special extra element that you're looking for in one of these dances? Well, the Korean uh, pop music, uh, they, these days they are very, you know, a technical. So you have a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, uh, you need a, uh, quite a lot of techniques mm -hmm. to to mimic. Uh, right. And I think they are all very good. Yeah. I think so too. I couldn't have pulled that off, but I think those uh, 30 to 45 minutes of practicing did them very good, and all of you can qualify as K-pop dancers in Singapore. You can get a new part-time job. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> you, you, you have a teenager 